This smells nice. You can see here, I guess. God, why did I have to dream of that? else can I clear my head? It's nice, but it's not working. I don't want them to really disturb me. They're still asleep, though. If I focus hard enough, can I just make them not be able to focus on me? We'll have to see. You should be awake. Let's head this way. Maybe I can pick up the rest. At least I'm not the last one up today. Hello, ma'am. Sorry, can I just... Thank you. Reading calms me down. Oh, and thank you. Yeah, yeah, I can take this back. Good morning, ma'am, by the way. Any word about any... No, no word. Can you put it out to all the teachers? That we really need to get in contact with Duncan. Shouldn't be up by now. <laughs> shouldn't. <sighs> Come on, Marie, let's check around the perimeter. Hey, guys. Bryn, there you are. Did you get back? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I didn't think you guys be awake by now. Uh, you woke up early for once. We were a bit worried. Oh uh, yeah, there's something. It's all right. Oh, I still thought geez. you guys would be asleep. Oh hell. I thought you were in danger or something. Jeez. You didn't even leave a note. Sorry. Huh? I did stop by Dahlia and pick up breakfast. Oh. She commented we've uh, never done that. I guess we haven't. Love to get us breakfast? That wasn't the intention, but it happened. 
Why'd you leave then? I needed some hair. Oh. <laughs> Don't we all? How you doing, Duncan? Better, I guess. Sorry for leaving the mud on your face. On, I can clean that off. By now it's pretty dry. You could just chip it off. It'd be easier to use water. Well, I'm gonna grab a piece of bread and another tea, if you don't mind. I guess I could have some jam on bread. Mm. Mm. Oh, is it good? Yeah. I've noticed she's been supplying a lot of earth food. This is normal food. Like the spaghetti? That's normal here? Yeah, it's a Valencian dish. Huh. This is new for me. It's delicious. <laughs> Yeah, it is delicious. Agree. I mean, the bread's still good. That's a plus from before. From not eating breakfast? No, no, from Earth. Oh. Did you not have bread on Earth? We do. Orphanage don't usually get the fresh stuff. Oh. That's... fair. What was the tastiest thing... in Earth, Brain? Honestly? When someone at school wasn't an orphan, had a birthday party with these little cupcakes. What's a cupcake? I've heard of those. Aren't they like cakes but smaller? Really small, yeah. And the frosting is sometimes piled up equal to the size of the cupcake. Huh. Really sweet. I've heard of... It sounds very tasty. I want to try one. Yeah, me too. Uh... You don't really get those really often on Stroll Island. I noticed the bazaar was selling them, but they're labeled as a pet snack. What? They make them for pets? Oh. You want to see if they're wizard safe? Mm. Yes. Still waking up. Oh. How do you sleep, Duncan? <coughs> Any dreams? No, I can remember. No. Well, that's good. At least nothing bad happened. Dally also said no word from any Duncans. Or clones. Of course not. I guess that's a blessing. I did check the life tower as well. Besides the, uh, really nice smelling potion he's got brewing. She did have her list of, uh, clones out. And one from Cyrus. Apparently she asked him for us. Ah. Uh, that works. So, including you... We're up to a hundred and six. Uh, that's a lot. Man. You know what? So, you know what Cyrus did that no one else did? 
Wait. He's, di he's written in dates for the last time he saw them. Wonder why he'd do that. A few of them, it's been definitely years. But he's listed seven. He's seen at least within the last week for their lessons. Like, actual classroom lessons? I don't know, their classroom. He also didn't know exactly which books he gave them on loan. Damn. Guess... You understood the assignment? I... That's too early for this shit. I think it's my turn to get some air. I'll be back. Be careful. Always will be. There's so what's a lot the plan? Of... I don't know. There's a lot of things to think about. Should we head back there in Karatopia? Well, looking for them didn't do anything, and... Our other idea didn't do anything. So at this point, discovering something important to draw one out might be your best bet. I mean, unless you want to hover around here for an entire week and see if we can literally jump a little Duncan going to with class. At that point, we've drawn the attention of the entire class. Let alone the Duncans. Not to mention, who knows if the uh, new Duncans know anything. Probably not. Considering he's got one on each day, they may not even know they exist. Say, Great. it's been a while. Professors heard the professors haven't given us any lessons that we should learn. Anything that they need, they they need our assistance for. Be wise to check. Cyrus just stopped me on my run to give me one. I go check I if Ray Rose needs something. Blaze, if you want to go get checked, I'm gonna go get dressed quick. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Duncan. for me, Lydia. I mean, Professor Grey Rose. It's a bad habit. What do you want, Marlene? Why are you still up here? That's cool. What's this cover? Such a weirdo. Good morning, ma'am. Oh, you have a thing for me, Miss Wu? Thank you. And in combat, it is always nice to have a com- One of- It is time to learn your next spell. When in combat, it is always nice to have a companion. I when shall teach you how I to that. summon one. Yes. All right. 
One of the items required to summon this companion is fairy wings. You will need to collect some on Unicorn Way from the dark fairies. All right, ma'am. After you have the fairy wings, you will need to go to the gazebo on Unicorn Way. There There's you will give the wings to a tree. life minion. Don't worry, the minion is very friendly. Good luck. Thank you, ma'am. Balance tree in Crocotopia? What? Something? Hmm? Oh. Uh, nothing really. Uh, Professor Gray Rose told me to to be careful out there. Kelvin told me that whatever it is that I'm looking for for my new spell, Balance Street might might help me with that. But we haven't seen a Balance Street. Huh? I got told to go get fairy wings off a dark fairy. Wait, I was also told to go get some wings of a dark fairy. Also, uh, Morlinda asked how you were, Duncan. Fine, I guess. Managing. And then she gave me frosted pretzels to hang out. I might be eating one right now. What is it with the teachers and feeding us? This is weird. Oh, crackhead. Forgot about that. What does he want? Haunted minion. I think we should head there while Prince doing that. And what's the plan? Um. I don't really know. <laughs> Just still trying to process. Where are your dark fairies? Uh, I was told to check the library in Crocotopia, so I guess we'll split up oh, and wow. see what we can do. Okay. Well, I'll head to Croc and take care of that. Um, I guess we'll meet back in a little bit. Yeah. Maybe I can find some clues on my. What about you? Got any new spells that you have to that you have to look for? Not really. Just a train some the spells that I need to work on. What if you checked with that creepy, um, dwarven guy? Dwargan? David? What was his name? I believe it's Dwargan. Something strange yeah, yeah, is yeah. in the air. Uh, I'm hearing music! Hello there, student of what life! Happened? I'm so glad that you called upon me for help. Join with okay? me in this I'm merry tune prince. that I play! Oh. Lame. Do you want to come see him? Actually, I don't. I've had enough of royalty after Colossus Boulevard. He has horns. The strange so dear. man takes from you the fairy wings and gives you an enchanted flower while you dance. Up. 
wants us to defeat his Scarlet Screamer. Screamer. I thought he wanted to hunt a minion. What? Oh. He's crazy. Don't even bother. Thank you for the Is flower. dancing not the most joyful thing? You cannot help but feel alive. Go now and always carry a song in your heart. Thank you. I have an enchanted flower. Talk Hitsy Princes and get enchanted flowers. I'm in a goddamn pyramid. Ugh. So dusty and at least you both know where your locations are at. I wish I knew. I don't know where this obelisk is at all. Ugh. Just like the old days. Very good, you have done well. There are more items needed, though. What else do we need, Miss Wu? Next, you'll need some acetate cloth. This is a cloth that has acetate special cloth. magical properties. Last I heard, the librarian, librarian in Crocotopia okay. had a supply of this special cloth. Uh, um, he uses I just left it to there. bind many of the old books they have there. Please see we if he can spare some for anyway. me. Yeah. Take the words out of my mouth. Collect some acetate cloth from the librarian in Crocotopia. By the way, you two. Hmm? Here's your frosted pretzels. Oh, thank you. Let's go kill a Scarlet Screamer. Well, right. What does he want? Today's assignment Scarlet is to Screamer. get a reading by defeating one of uh, these creatures in this that. location. Good luck. All right. There you are, you wee bastards. Where are you two? I'm at the Banshees. Already there. Oh, nice. Let's go fight him. You doing all right, Siri? Yeah, just a 3v1. Take him.
Ah, uh, seriously. Ugh. Crap. Sorry. Fine. I have her. All right. I can't focus on Siri. Can any of you? Let me check. No, I cannot. Nope. Blaze, I think you need to go <coughs> to the world gate for us. Uh, Siri? Hang in, in there. Shit. Okay, going. One down. One. Ah, uh, Duncan, I'm getting concerned for her. I'm at the gate. We can't really do anything about it, unfortunately. I'm at the gate. I'm at the gate. You need to go through it to Krakatopia. Yeah. <sighs> Lucky name. Struggle luck. Sir. Sorry, can you hang on there? I don't know. None of my pitsies are showing up in my hand. Shit! Thank you for the ride, Blaze. And this guy wants me again. Hello, sir. Greetings, young Jeez. wizard. I was wondering if you could do something for me. I am in the middle of making a necklace oh, boy. and just discovered that I'm this going to need a fire gym. Can you go to Ravenwood and see if Dahlia Falmea uh, has an extra fire gym? When I can, sir. Siri? Go see Dahlia Falmea and see if you can get a fire gym from her. Siri? Siri? Oh, this is just like Golem Tower. Is she? Sorry. Oh, there you are. Oh. And she's unconscious. This is too big for you, Misty. Come on. Did you guys smell her? Unconscious. Okay, I'm gonna head back. Sorry. Let's leave her here to rest. What is her teacher thinking? Focusing on you, Brand. Is he trying to kill her? 
wouldn't surprise me. Hello, sir. You need acetate, acetate cloth? You have come to the yes, right sir. place. I just I'm happen to you. have some. Thank you. Come on. The librarian hands you a bolt of the cloth. <sighs> Let me guess. This is for your next spell? Mm -hmm. I wish I had the time to study magic, but a librarian's work is never done. Time to reshelve some more scrolls. Thank you regardless. Piece of shit, god damn it! Ugh, my head, it's killing me. What got you? Ugh, three nasty pixies. Ugh. Pixies? I thought you needed yeah. to get dark sprites. Fucking whatever, they're. <sighs> they were nasty fuckers. One of them armor and. They just kept throwing sunbirds like it was nothing. Maybe I can uh, offer you some treasure cards? Oh, uh, those things? Uh, I didn't even realize I had them. God. Of course I didn't have healing spells in it, because you always heal us. Damn. It was, just, it was my fault. I was stupid. I'm sorry. You're not stupid. It's just yes, a simple I am. Yeah, well, it's a simple mistake I can't afford to make. He's already on my ass enough as it is. Just, just don't tell Professor Drake. I'll never my hear the end of that asshole. Do you want some cards? <sighs> I have some of these minor blessings. They don't take any pips. You think that'll work? I've also got this really fancy pixie. I got those. I wouldn't mind. Are you sure you're really gonna part with me? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what would I do without you? I have no idea. If you, I guess I'll take some of those blessings and once my head clears up, I'll try that again. I saw some. I have to get back. What exactly did they get called? What do you... Well, those obviously weren't normal pixies. Those... Oh, I, I found some he... more things. Oh. Let's the best. Um, I'm not gonna let you go empty-handed, so... Got. I'll let I'll let you some big ones. Uh, this might help, but just in case. Yeah, it might. There you go. Thanks. So I ain't got much. <laughs> Usually, keep those. Be really careful. Stack up on your shields. Right. No, that better for next time. I hope she's doing all right. Uh, Duncan, you said you needed a balance train. Yeah, but I can't well, find I'm one anywhere. Isn't that a balance tree? That one right there. Three? Oh man, what'd you put? How, how, how do we get there? Sarah, can we have a ride? 
This boat goes to the Kraka Sphinx. You'll need permission from Sergeant Major Talbot to get on the boat. Really? If the sergeant has already given you permission, simply climb aboard and it will take you to the other island. Uh... Would it immediately be stupid if I were to go try that again? Did you try and summon minions? Oh yeah, I could do that! That's not a bad idea. So can I now. Well, after I turn in this cloth, I'm gonna focus on my home and skip the world gate. Okay, so with that and many, I guess I can do it. I'll, uh, <laughs> wish me luck. Good luck! <laughs> Are you sure you're off in. alone? Excellent! I knew I could count on the librarian for the acetate cloth. Sorry. Huh? Are you sure you don't want company? I'll be fine. What Some... else do you need, ma'am? The next item we will need is a green gem. Strangely enough, this is a common request, and Gordon Fleming usually has one. All right. You can find Gordon at the dig site in Crocotopia. Go seek him and ask him for a green gem. Got it. I'm focusing on you, Blaze. Talk to Gordon Fleming in the Crocotopia dig site right, to see shits. if he has a green gem. Let's try this again. I just need to go get a green gem. From Gordon Fleming. I'm also trying to brainstorm how we get Duncan his permission. Green gem. You need a green gem? They take a little time to polish. I have a few ready, but well they're spoken for. Stocks. I can give you one of those, but maybe, I'll need a rough gem to replace it with. Trust us. All right. And we can get in there is a rumor fresh. that there is a unique green gem somewhere here in the dig site. Yeah. Bastards. I'm having a we booger of a time that. finding it. Really? Okay. I'll find it. Do me a favor and search around here for it. It's got to be somewhere around here. Yes, sir. Green gems can be very useful. Sir, are you blind? <sighs> oh, wait, dogs are colorblind. You dislodge a green gem from the statue. Probably looked brown to him. Oh. oh. Here you go, Is sir. Guy again? What is his name? Well Ash? done. I'll give you one of the prepared gems so you don't have to wait. I'll get to work on this one now. No one will be the wiser. Good luck. Thank you, sir. Hey, focus on home. Oh, this, this, this purple guy, Hedge is his name? He needs, he, he needs a favor for us, from us. All right, let me turn in this gem. Here you go, ma'am. 
Wonderful! Now that we have all the ingredients, we can begin. Mulenda starts to weave all the uh, items sure. together. Yeah, what about right. that one over there behind you? That's not either color. There we go. All done. And this okay. is for you. Thank you, ma'am. Ooh, I can go on my wall. Why can't you do it? Uh, I guess it'd be a good history lesson. Oh, that's a pickle. Where do I put this? I can make room for it. No, not there. Maybe if I move this one over here. This one right. Over here. And that one's big. Really use your help. <sighs> Perfect. Focusing on you, Blaze. Yeah. Storm, huh? Also, the uh, purple guy, Hedge, I believe, he made a favor, so... I'll go check with him. <laughs> Sand. Hello, dear. Greetings, student of wizardry. I must say that I am always delighted to see people from the other worlds, though some cause me distress. Oh? For example, Major Talbot keeps staring at me as if I were an amusement. Manders may look strange to some, but we have our pride. Everyone has pride. Some gotta swallow it. He's intimidating me with his stare, and I'm afraid to confront him. Could you talk to him for me? As an officer Manders and a are quite shy by nature, Do you know. Do it yourself. Sure. Oh, who am I kidding? Nobody does think that themselves. Would you be so bold as to talk to Major mm. Talbot for me? Please? I'm just too shy to do it myself. What? It's concluded that I thought he looked odd. Yeah. Well, I must say that Mandas are very different than anything we have in Marlebone. Mm -hmm. Actually, I was puzzled as to why he is purple. All the others I've seen are either blue or orange. Have you noticed that? I noticed that's a little bit racist, but sure. I feel my ignorance oh, embarrasses one, me. One, two Would in you be a so row? good as to talk to Zene? <sighs> Ask why the Mandas are the colors they are. Oh, the water from the wall does seem nice. Oh, come on! I guess before I go, I should take a sip as well. Sir, are you going uh, okay? Uh. Sir? <sighs> I should say it's good. Yeah. For the pressure. Major wanted to know uh, why yeah, Mandos yeah. are the colors they are? Actually, I'm surprised that no one from Marleybone has asked before. Yes, sir. So what's the reason? Originally, Manders were green, but some of our forefathers served the different orders. The pyramid is of the fire order. Manders who served it changed to orange. What else? The crocus sphinx is of the order of ice. Those oh, Manders sorry. who are blue in nature are descendants of those whose ancestors served ice. Oh? The tomb is of the storm order. Manders such as Hedge Aldim, purple in nature, are oh. descendants of those who served storm. That does make sense. I guess the elements became a part of our four Manders long ago, and that is why we are four different colors. Take this, or you're gonna die of thirst. Oh, Siri, you okay? No. So we back let, on the tent. Don't make me do that shit again. Uh, I'm not the second time. Don't, don't let me. Uh, it. 
Seriously, it was two of your damn trees and my damn bird fucking... Uh, I'm on my way. I'm fine. Oh, Zeke had some yum and put it down my gullet and I'm fine, but I'm not doing times. that again. You know what I mean, Smithy? Uh, fine, let me get up. Oh, uh, maybe I'm not fine. Uh, Here, I've got you, I've got you. <sighs> Let's get you on the horse. Yeah. Or he's just outside. And alley uh, uh, Sorry, girl. All no right, more of that. Uh... Maybe don't get knocked out a third time. Yeah, Medically, I'm... people who get knocked out a lot... Sometimes they can die. Tell See, me about it. Almost felt that yesterday. He told me as much. One more good hit on the head and I'm... <laughs> I may be stupid, but I'm not that stupid. We found Duncan's balance tree. Oh, where is it? All the way Nowhere that we can there. reach, that's for sure. Oh. Can't we just hijack the boat? We can't. The captain's we need to... watching. We need the sergeant's permission. Ah, oh, that's stupid. What if we hijack that boat? That boat? Uh... How yeah, are we even just... reaching that boat? Somehow. I can sail it easy. Well, maybe not in my condition, but on a good day. <laughs> Let's find a way to it first. Hmm. Island by it seems to have some kind of glow. Like the glow over there. Oh, it's probably one of those... Teleporters. Probably one of those tele... Uh. Oh. Hang in there. Uh. Alright, that door's locked. And this That's official. If we get into another fight, we're gonna have to keep... It's an unattended hey. rowboat. Where the... The oars are stuck. If we get into another fight, we're gonna have to prioritize hey, her safety among all else. Yeah. Hello, little goat guy. Regardless of you what you say. Don't answering, okay. Well, we can't steal the rowboat. And he's not answering us. Let's go back down. Nope. Huh? Probably if it's Mushu. It is a, it is a Mushu skiff after all. You mean Chinese? No, I mean Mushu. What's Chinese? An Eastern Earth language. Yes, Mushu is. Oh, I forgot to tell the sergeant something quick. Please give me permission to the boat. The Manders are different colors because their four Manders serve the three orders of fire, ice, and storm. Gadzooks! It makes a sort of sense now. Can I get permission for the boat? Damn, for I guess minute. my curiosity got the better of me. The email As an officer and a gentleman, please to... apologize to Hedge for to me. I didn't mean to be inconsiderate. I think so. Fine. No boat permission. It's okay. We'll get that permission later. Oh, Major yeah, Talbot didn't, didn't know. know why Manders are different? I thought everyone knew why. No wonder why he was so curious. I feel better now. Say, could you do me huh? a favor? I was supposed sure. to fill up a canteen for the professor. The well water by the shop tastes the best if you could fill it for me. I'll get a drink too. The professor is just inside the pyramid. I'm sure he will be grateful for your service. Of course. Have you filled the canteen uh, and taken it to the professor? Sorry? I'm sure he's more than thirsty by now. Concussed or not? What happens when that red reaches the top of the obelisks? 
Oh. Because I just saw it increase. Oh. Let me go take a look. May have been hit on the but my hoodoo should be just fine. Oh, it's another one of those. Well, I mean, aren't the crocs also around? I would say that's the bigger issue, but I do understand. I, don't, I do understand it. Oh, there's a glow on the island right over there. Hmm, oh, that's this is timed. Yeah. It would explain the yeah. hourglass symbols. And the slowly filling bar. Just you are cursed. Based on the location alone. Oh, I almost forgot the water. water. Somewhere. Why don't you catch up with the boys? Eight. Stay safe, girl. You want us to fight your own fill up the people? canteen from the well. Where did you guys go? Are you in the pyramid already? Yeah. Uh. I don't think I can focus on you without throwing up again, so... I'll be riding it. What? Take your time. Yeah. I'll be behind you. Drink of this water. Why? Thank you for bringing the canteen. The air is so dry here, it can bring on a thirst that can make you dizzy. You're welcome, sir. Gadzooks! That's the best water I've ever tasted. Well, can you, you take this canteen to Dr. Force, Fleming at the dig site? He thinks all the water here on Croc is salty. Sure, sir. Go find my assistant, Malcolm Danforth, yes, yes, and sir. help I'll him find that. a way to get inside the palace. He's in the excavation room in the Chamber of Fire. Dr. Fleming, taste this so Two I can get moving. Pizza, okay. Of course you are. Try the water. All the water on Crocotopia tastes salty due to all the sand. I sometimes wish I had stayed back in Marleybone. Great Majesty of the Queen, that water is delicious. Thank you. I will always endeavor to fill my canteen at the well from now on. Yep, that's where I got it. You know, I found an old Manda scroll. Could you give it to Hetch in appreciation for bringing this incredible water to my attention? Sure. Thanks again, young wizard. Uh, let's see. Huh? Wait a sec. Have my eyes deceived me, or is that another... Oh, must be another beetle. Beauty is... Wait. Is it... Here, Hetch. Dr. Fleming found an ancient Manda like scroll? A... Yes. Now I wish I had listened to my great great grandmander when he tried to teach me how to read the old language. Wow, that's an old salamander. I would really like to know what is on this ancient mander scroll. Would you do me a favor and ask Professor Winthrop what it says? Please? All right. Have you been able to find out what is on the mander scroll? I am sure one of the Marleybonians can read it. Can you read this? You would like me to translate an ancient Manda scroll? Well, I'm not versed in ancient Manda, but I know Danforth is. See him at the excavation site. Got it, sir. Go find my assistant, Malcolm Danforth, and help him find a way to get inside the palace. He's in the excavation room in the Chamber of Fire. That is fair. I'm joining you, Duncan. Where's Danforth? And the beetle. He, he's down there. Beetle is... Uh, uh, beetle is over here. Uh, Bombing. Hey, there you guys are. <clears throat> Lot of sand. How you doing? Fine. Thanks. No Have you seen Salami Mendor? Yeah, he he's on the other side of this uh excavation of this, uh, zone. Yeah. Got it. Danforth, sir, I have some things for you. 
You're to help me find a way inside the palace? Excellent! Mm -hmm. You say you need some ancient yes, Manda sir. translated? I'll do my best. Hmm, it says that there is a beguiler who has been charming the Mandas. Slaver. The Mandas have been enslaved due to this mage's spells. They say there is a chamber nearby that houses the souls of the ancient charmed Mandas. Oh dear. Probably just a myth. I'd investigate, but I'm far too busy. Can you search outside the excavation? Look for a door with two obelisks beside it. Tell me if you find it. All right, sir, and also... As far as I can tell, the palace requires a keystone to unlock the door. Of course. My partner, Robert Lancaster, has been searching for the keystone. All right. See if you can find him, while I see if I can't whip up some other way in. All right, sir. Find my partner, Robert Lancaster, but to see if he's found the keystone door. needed to unlock the palace. Where do you think Where that obelisk this? door is? Oh, there's Salab. I was in here earlier. I think I saw it. Hello, Salam. Where did you see You it? want to know about the history um, of the Mandar yes, race? Kind of the I'm sure you know we have been way. slaves of Crocs for ages. Curse their proud snouts. We were too weak-minded and the Crocs took advantage of us. But then, when the Crocs were yeah. cast into the sleep, uh -huh. we thought we would be free again. Ha! Huh? But are we free? Charm. Now the Marlebonians have come oh. here, and we are servants again. Called? And they are stealing our history right out from under our very feet. Real England vibes. We that's need to be free from the curse of the Crocs said. and all these meddlesome uh, Marlebonians. If only we could break this curse that we live under. Right. Please, good young wizard, help me. The wicked Tuts have enslaved my people. I'll help how I can. They use terrible magic to force us to work here in the pyramid. Please allow us to be free of their oppression. I'll do whatever I can. Help me break the charm. Defeat oh. charmed slaves oh. in battle so we might be free. Okay. Most generous wizard, please defeat charmed slaves so that my lowly people might be free. But first, I need to tell Zanae this information before I forget it. I have the history, Zane. You learned all that by talking with Salam? Yes, sir. Quite the hothead he is. I hope he does not stir up too much trouble. The Manders are a docile race, you know. Uh, yeah. Wait. Did you did you two say that the Hatch obelisk was the chamber of the away? chosen? I have heard yeah. that the text of our ancestors were stored there, that, but no that one knows where that chamber look like is. It from, uh, from my mm. point of view. Could you find down. out information about it? I fear rousing the Marlebonians' curiosity, maybe though. The window. But maybe Prospector Zeke would know of it. Maybe. I'll ask him. Talk to Prospector Zeke just outside. He's probably still looking for those beetles again. Wait, beetles again? Hmm. Jumping horn toads! You say you're looking for the yep. Chamber of the Chosen? I thought that was a Mander myth. None of them Marlebonians believe it be existing. Do you? But I did see some glyphs concerning that chamber down in the Royal Hall. Take this parchment and make a rubbing of the glyphs. Sure, sir. Then take the parchment back to Zanae for translating. Look for a statue with only one brazier. Just pass the dig down there. Got it, sir. Chamber of Joseph. Why would he say he's looking for the beetles again? Done. Just past the dig, only one brazier. Let's see. 
Where's that keystone? Found it. Now the rubbings. Uh, one. I found Take a statue a with only at one the brazier. Base. Oh. See if I can focus on you. Hmm. Okay. I'm good. I'm taking this to Zane. Alright. Uh, uh, it's bad. Oh, right. Anna, a dungeon field. You found writing relating to the chamber of the chosen. Give me a moment to translate it. Alas, I cannot translate this. This uses glyphs I do not recognize. Talk with Tinu Bakmal. He is more familiar with such things. Mm, oh, okay. One. Have you deciphered the glyphs yet? Again. It is so good to see you, my friend. No one ever comes down here to visit with me. I don't know why. I might have an idea. Ooh, you need me to translate your glyphs? Yes, I study glyphs as a hobby. Not many people do it, you know. I can assume. Ooh, you need to go to the lower level of the Altar of Kings. Down there you will find the sacred chamber. You will find it there. Yes. Great, thank you, bye. Go see Dahlia Falmea and yeah, see yeah, if you yeah, can get a fire it. gem from her. How did you not recognize it if you're a library? Ugh. It's like asking a librarian in New York to translate Latin, Duncan. There's old language and there's really old language. And, uh. You find the hallway blocked. Report this. That's great. Oh no! Yeah, the lower hallway leading to the Chamber of the Chosen is blocked? The old scrolls of the Mander race are lost! Wait! The hallway oh, in the left. Altar of Kings was damaged the when the Marleybonians yeah. began their excavations. Oh, what is, what is Maybe someone was in there before they collapse. Then what? Check with Professor Winthrop. Okay, sir. He was overseeing the excavations, so he should surely know what is beyond the hallway. I'm sure Professor Winthrop knows what is beyond the hallway collapse. Ugh. That's why. There's no way to get there. If you're going to Zane, Duncan, you can focus on me. And maybe take a deep breath, too. Oh. There you are, Blaze. What's up? Much. Here, let me. Yes. Oh, you want a child? Cool. I was asked to break the spell on a few of these guys. Should it be too tough? Not with those damp seas. Whatever they're called. Sarah, do you know a way into that chamber? Yes, I jolly well uh... remember that hallway crashing in on us. Luckily, no one got hurt. Luckily? You can get to the same place through one of the doors in the Chamber of Fire. 
Just turn right at the first intersection. Nothing of value in there. It's all right. I got you. Friend, what's wrong? Nothing of value in there. <laughs> I feel like history is pretty valuable. Shove my helmet on, even. Oh, what I needed. Okay. I'm gonna focus on you guys. Uh. Any luck with that door of two obelisks? Uh... I found it earlier, I could show you too. Great. And I, I, I can't bring myself to hurt the Manders. If it's any consolation, I did notice that whatever spell they're under seems to break when we knock them down. It's not. Still hurts them. I know. You don't have to do if you don't want to. Thanks for the shield. Just trying to stop and touch trying to see concussion. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess if there's any bright side, I'd say that I know how you feel. I swear, he has... he had a lot of headaches from all that crap recent. I, I don't know. Oh, Whatever, yeah, I'm just yeah. trying to be funny. <laughs> Thank you. You've already been beaten on the head twice. Yeah. I can still feel the bump. That fire shield. I got it. Just you don't have to look, Bren. Thanks. Chamber. It's over here, but one of them dropped some. What did he drop? Some kind of staff with a bell? Uh, here's Salam. Oh, great and kind wizard. You have done it. A thousand blessings upon you. Thank you. 
Oh, great and powerful one. If you were to take the touch colors of ascent, they could never charm us again. Really? Please defeat the Nirini Crocs but... in combat and take the vile the colors from oh, them. Would you do this for my people? Fails. Of course. Uh, maybe Please, oh great and powerful one, defeat Nirini Crocs like and take the colors of Essence oh. so that the touch might never charm us again. Yeah, she showed me how to stitch this, I guess. Okay. I guess I'll ask her later. Now I kind of don't want to be without power, you know? Yeah. Uh, I'll be back. But yeah, um, once we left, you should have turned left and you should be able to see it. Did you find it? I don't see any obelisks, just a brazier. Good. Was it the other direction? No, it's left. We might as get closer. I'll look around. No, that's the chamber of the chosen. Thank you, Miss Eloise. <laughs> oh, screen my voice. I'm coming to you. Now I see them. You locate the chamber yeah, see, of the there you go. I guess I have to report to Danforth first. Sorry, Danforth. I guess once she's up to speed, then we can enter, huh? Looks like it. Please, oh great and powerful one, defeat Nirini Crocs and take the colors of Ascent so that the touch might never charm uh, us again. Duncan, can I ask you a weird question? What's up? Whenever we've been wandering around these halls and tombs and stuff, have you seen anything that looks like it doesn't belong here? Other than all the dots and their stuff. You found the chamber yes, sir, already? I found it. You would make a great archaeologist. That's an important find for the Manders. Not you may want to tell Hetch right away. Right. I don't think so. Why is that? Nothing. I'm just looking for something. Found the chamber of the charmed. You found the chamber of the charmed? I thought that was just a myth. I'm glad you got that scroll translated. So am I. I heard that the souls of the charmed manders are being held there. It may be a myth, but can you please look into it? Of course. The chamber is within the pyramid. You'll have to go down to the chamber of fire to find the room. All right, I'm here. Is everyone else here? This one. You sure like getting lost, don't Again. you, please? I'm talking to Sena. Going back to you guys. Alright. Focusing on you, Duncan. I'm here. Let's head in. Hopefully this upgrade will make the difference. Please! Save us from our eternal enslavement! 
Even in the afterlife, we are still bound to serve our master. Save us from the Soul Keeper. The Soul Keeper? Cold heat. Ah! Every single time the undead. You've got to be kidding me. I'm here. Ah. Uh, there's some bad hoodie. Life wizards and the undead, huh? Really cold here, too. At fire shields, okay. Wait, Siri, how do you already have four pips? Well, what? Two on a power pip. What? Wait, huh? Where did that one come from? I honestly don't know. Oh, weird. Must be a fluke. Used to do. Whoa, that was weird. What was that? I don't know. It's one of these, one of the powers of the wand, I guess. <laughs> Bell, rather. I don't know what it is. Yep. We gotcha. I'm good. Just a little nippy. We still gotcha. <laughs> I'll let you boys handle it. Try not to be hugged by them again. Stick to the wolves best you can. Not even their souls are at rest. This is disgusting. There he is. Bastard.
Hey! Why do I have two? Yeah, that's what I noted. That's weird. Wait, you know what? Maybe it's the bell. Weird. That's rough. Got you, Siri. Think you can just come in here? You can just come. Fool! You think you can just come in here and take my manders? They are mine for all eternity. See what I can find. <laughs> you gotta be shitty. Can I get him? Go right ahead. Sure. Get the rest. That takes not, ma not making a dent. Sorry for the trouble. Really, it's not. You are getting a lot of power pips, though. Uh, yeah. Yes, I am. <laughs> but nothing to use them with.
Thank you for freeing us, young wizard. All of us within this chamber can now go to a peaceful afterlife. Yes! <sighs> and a teleporter. Alium? We all just stepped into that, not knowing if we weren't going to get sent somewhere bad. Yeah, well... There's no more bad voodoo coming out of that place. Let's go tell Hedge. Yeah. You freed the souls of the Charm Manders from the Soul Keeper. I never could have hoped for such a thing of those trapped in eternal slavery. A million blessings upon you and your skills, Master Wizard. Now where's that chamber of the Chosen? Or do you think we should take a lunch break here? Or, yeah. well, it's not even noon yet. Maybe a snack? Maybe. Where do we want to have a snack? How about Wizard City? We still have to ask the... I still have to ask Dahlia about a fire gem. Oh, yeah. They did ask about... <laughs> and we kind of need you guys to do the world gate. Right. Let's do that quick and grab a snack. I'll teleport to my dorm room. Oh yeah, right. A little, a little worried about those dandelions I planted. Um, I'm actually trapped by some croc, but I'm gonna catch you guys later. Don't worry. Uh, oh. you don't need help, right? No. You say so. Just don't get lost. No. Don't worry. I just saw a glowing saber-toothed animal. <laughs> that wasn't nearly as bad as teleporting. Dahlia, do you have, uh, any fire gems? So, you need a fire gem. I'll see if I have one. Give me a moment. Oh my. It seems that I ran out. My normal supplier is Gustav Copperflame, the ring shopkeeper. You can ask him if he has any. All right. Go ask Gustav Copperflame, the ring shopkeeper, if he has any. Wonder if I at the bruise. Is there anything for a snack soon? Oh, okay. What were you doing, Siri? Hey, Miss Dap. Mm. Fine, I'm not a little kid. Yeah, whatever, just. Hmm. Knew, I knew I'd regret seeing Dahlia today. What'd she do? She's just so... She was so doting on me for some reason. I hit the bruise from the last fight. Well, we are just kind of... This is the day after we reported being stalked. Wait. Hi, sir. Do you have a fire gem? So you told you need that to the teachers? So you a fire gem. I normally have some in stock. I embed them in <sighs> some of the rings I make. Great. Unfortunately, they have been in great demand lately, and I don't have any. You can normally find them in the Dragon's Mouth Cave, next to the Living Flame. Thank you, sir. Go explore the Dragon's Mouth Cave. You may be able to find a fire gem in there. Yeah, we told the teachers. Where do you think we got the list of clones from? 
I don't know. I thought you guys lied and said that you were looking for his relatives. No wonder the teachers are on edge and doting on us all the time. Jeez. I think it's a good thing. Maybe they're also, you know, watching out for us. They're just watching us in general. Destroyed. Here we go. Ooh. Right behind you. Whoa. That is actual lava. Okay. You remove a fire gem from the living flame. We just reach in and I can reach into actual fire. Okay. I expect it to get burned. Why are there no guardrails? There's lava in here. I mean, there was a gate. Yeah, it was. It's a nice broken. statue, though. I wonder where Blaze is. Blaze? Oh. I'm finishing my stuff here. Oh, good. You didn't get knocked out. No, no. Before we give this back to Tanu, Dahlia said she'd whip up a snack for us. That was nice of her. Yeah, but she said we'd get the snack from uh, Melinda. I guess maybe they can talk to each other like that crazy psychic owl. Or... Most. Thank you, ma'am. It's apples, but it's something. Maybe we can cut in... Maybe we can cut in the wedges for us. Should we have a picnic in the old fairground area, maybe? Or do we want to try eating in one of the big towers? Um... Wherever's fine. Don't really feel like playing games during lunch, though. Where do you want to eat, Duncan? Whichever's fine. Well... No one's usually in Miss Wu's tower. And it smells really nice in there. Focusing your brain. Alright, we got apple slices. Oh. Cool. We can eat at her desk. It is pretty deep. And look, right here, she's still got the papers. Her list and Cyrus's list. Along with actual dates of when he's last seen them. And what books he gave them. Huh, he named- he numbered his copies. Of books. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's cuckoo. And he priced the books. Okay. What? Do the others owe him money? <laughs> well, if they get a book destroyed, suppose he'd want them to pay him back. Yes. Let's just have our snack. Come on, guys. Right. Come on, Duncan. Blaze. 